Charles immediately strips Beatrice titles as gave Harry permission to film inside Queen's Cottage. Princess Beatrice gave Prince Harry and Meghan Markle permission to film inside the Queen's private cottage, according to new reports. The Sussex couple's controversial new Netflix documentary series Harry and Meghan features footage of them inside Wyberth in Bark, an outsize Wendy house close to Royal Lodge in Windsor Great Park. Originally gifted to a young then Princess Elizabeth from the people of Wales in 1932, 34-year-old Beatrice was granted custodianship of the cottage by Her Majesty in 2010. A close friend of Harry and Meghan's, the young royal is now understood to have given, the Sussexes, the nod to bring cameras inside, according to the Daily Mail. It is not known when this filming would have taken place. In the documentary Harry and Meghan were also heard complaining about their time in Nottingham Cottage, a house in the grounds of Kensington Palace which they moved into following their royal wedding in 2018. The pair claimed the building, which had previously been home to Prince William and Princess Kate after they had Prince George, was so small that Oprah Winfrey was left shocked when she came over to visit. As far as people were concerned we were living in a palace. But, we were living in a cottage, says Harry. On palace grounds. Kensington Palace sounds very regal of course, it does say palace in the name. But Nottingham Cottage was small, explains Meghan. Harry adds, the whole thing was really small on a slight lean with low ceilings. Despite knowing that his brother was the previous resident, Harry jokingly adds, whoever lived there before must have been small. Meghan also said that her husband hit his head constantly because he's so tall. She adds, it was a chapter in our lives where I don't think anyone could believe what it was actually like behind the scenes. Charles is said to be very angry because Beatrice helped Harry to sabotage the royal family. A royal expert has claimed King Charles III may strip Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie of their titles despite being 9th and 11th in line to the throne. Hilary Ford which told Fox News Digital Prince Andrew's two daughters may become the next casualties of the king's plans to slim down the monarchy. Unfortunately for princesses Eugenie and Beatrice, their father's conduct has had rather an adverse and actually disastrous impact on their royal futures, she said. The princesses are most likely to become Lady Beatrice and Lady Eugenie since their father, Prince Andrew's, sexual assault scandal has purportedly poured ruin on their chances of becoming working royals. The Duke of York is now eighth in line to the throne after his mother Queen Elizabeth II's death on September 8. However, he has been stripped of his military affiliations and HRH title after his controversial friendship with convicted sex traffickers Jeffrey Epstein and Ghislaine Maxwell. Ms. Ford which claimed Princesses Beatrice and Eugenie retaining their titles is highly dubious because Charles is predicted to be making the use of titles more restrictive. It wasn't just their father's conduct, she told Fox News Digital but he knowingly and willingly embarrassed the entire royal family with not only his friendships but by also agreeing to his diabolical Newsnight interview. His refusal to help the FBI with their investigation into the aforementioned served to compound all his other errors of judgment. It comes amid reports there are heightening tensions between King Charles III and the Duke and Duchess of Sussex over the future of Archie and Lilibet's royal titles. The line of succession shifted following the death of Queen Elizabeth II and the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's two children, Archie and Lilibet, automatically became Prince and Princess.